consider all the world thine hands hath made. I see the stars, I hear the rolling thunder, thy power throughout the universe display. Then sings my soul, my Savior God, to thee. How great thou art. Beautiful, isn't it? How great thou art. Then sings my soul, my Savior God, to thee. How great thou art, how great thou art. When Christ shall come with shouts of acclamation and take me home, what joy shall fill my heart. Then I shall bow in humble adoration and there proclaim, my God, how great thou art. Then sings my soul, my Savior God, to thee. How great thou art, how great thou art, then sings my soul, my Savior God, to thee, how great thou art, how great thou art. how great our God is. You know, we come to visit our cabin here. Our cabin is just right there, a little island here that we walk out to on a sandbar when the tide is out. And uh, you can't help but think of that song when you come here. How great is our God? The songwriter was saying, when I, when I see this, when I see one of the verses, we're at the cabin, I don't have all the words, but one of the verses says, when I look down from lofty mountains grandeur and hear the brooks and, and hear, hear the, the birds sing sweetly in the tree and so on and the wind blowing softly. It's, it, it, the creation is amazing. And so the songwriter is saying, I see this and as a result of seeing it, my soul sings. Ever think about what that means? My soul sings. What, what, what does that mean? Well, if I look and I observe the beauty of his creation, my soul, which is my mind, my will, and my emotion, all uh, are impacted by this. And as, as a result, it's like I just want to say something. I just want to sing. I want to whistle. I want to shout. Wow! And people start saying, what a beautiful day. Notice how people just greet one another and say, a nice day, isn't it? Wow, this is a nice day for a walk. It's a nice day because it's a nice creation. And so my mind is, is engaged. When I see this, my mind sings. It's, it's an intellectual ascent. What, I'm just, I'm, I'm just my, my uh, um, intellectual capacity is engaged because this has to be something greater than an evolutionary um, occurrence. It's created. It's too perfect. And my emotions are engaged. I'm excited. I'm delighted. People travel from all around the world just to see the different uh, uh, sceneries and different creative um, 
uh, genius that God has, has done around the world. And so we get excited. We, we, we pay all kinds of money just to get there and just to relax and enjoy this rugged beauty, my mind, my will, my emotions. And so today, I just want to engage you for a moment. I want to invite you from wherever you are. You may be sitting in a, in a very heated um, location somewhere now in the world where there's a heat wave. And uh, you may be, you know, finding it a little bit difficult to breathe and so on. I want to share something that's going to bring a breath of fresh air to you. God loves you. God loves you right where you are. He created this creation when, because he was thinking about you. You know what else he did? He went to Calvary's cross and suffered and died and gave his life for you also. So that you can live with him in the next place that he's gone to prepare. Much more beautiful than this. You know, it's got streets of gold and gates of pearl. Heaven is a wonderful place. God is going to prepare for those that love and serve him. I invite you today, from wherever you are, consider Jesus. Consider our creator God. And invite him into your heart today. Get to know him. He's, he's an amazing uh, God. He's a God who... Who not only is he big enough to create all of this, but he's small enough to come and live within your heart. Invite Jesus into your heart today. Make him the Lord of your life. And uh, you know what? Even though this may look good to you now, but when he becomes your Lord, this looks even better because you know who created it all from within your spirit, man. And you can say with a songwriter, My soul sings! I can't help but shout! Can you hear my echo today? It goes out across the arm here. And I can say, Hallelujah! And the echo comes back. It's an amazing place to live. Give Jesus your heart and learn to live forever and ever. Amen. God bless you.